All right, Lewis Central gets the win tonight here in this regional semifinal over Carroll, 49-32. Now here with Brooke Larson and Lucy Scott, a couple of big contributors here tonight, and just to kind of start us off here, obviously you get the win here in this semifinal. Thoughts and kind of takeaways here from this one? Yeah, so obviously Carroll's a really athletic and long team, and, you know, they they have play great D, and, um, you know, the first and second quarter we really went out there and we ha didn't have trouble scoring, you know, we didn't turn the ball over and we played pretty well, and then we just get to the third and fourth, and they started to pressure us and we kind of struggled under, but we won in the end, so we advanced. Yeah, we had a really good first half. We were minimal on mistakes. We, our defense was amazing. We kept them off the def or offensive boards, and we knew that's what would kill us if we allowed them to get a lot of those. And then I think we just came in a little over our heads the second half, but we can put four quarters together. Yeah. So, yeah kind of speak to that defensive effort, yielding the six points there in that first half. What did you guys feel was really working on that side of the ball for you guys? Well, we're one of the top defenses in the state, no doubt. We let up like 35 points a game. and. Um, I just think, you know, knowing who their shooters are and limiting their shots on the inside, they didn't make, you know, one set play like bucket in that fir first half, which we were really impressed about. It was just scramble balls. So, yeah, limiting them to six points um, definitely led us into the third and fourth and gave us a big advantage coming into it. And obviously, you know, Lucy had a big advantage there going into that second half, but they closed it a little bit. Uh, just kind of what's the what's the message there you guys are as you guys are holding on to that lead there late in that one? Um, I don't know you I just think it's, you know, like, it's tough. We turn the ball over a couple times, and when we were going in late, it's just, you know, we can't turn the ball over, and that's what happened. And so I think Hannafin was just saying, you know, we have to embrace the pressure on this, and, like, they're obviously, you know, delivering a lot of pressure right now. So I just think, you know, we can't turn the ball over, make our free throws in the end of that stretch, and come out with the win. Yeah, coming into the second half, we definitely stepped back a little bit, and we could have come out stronger, but, yeah, we were just, yeah. Sure, and obviously, at least lead the way tonight, it was 19 points. You found a couple of shots from deep there in that second half. Just kind of kind of speak to your performance here tonight. Um. Well, thank you, guys. I was just finding open shots, and my teammates Thanks, do a really good job of creating shots for me, and we have a lot of good sets that we can Thanks, run with multiple um, options, and so just running those and executing our offense really well just gets open shots for anyone. So, Brookie, 14 points for you tonight. What did you kind of see? What was out, what, out there on the floor, to you, uh, floor tonight for you offensively? Yeah, offensively, I just had a lot of lanes, so obviously my teammates were getting me the ball, and a lot of lanes were being created. Just I was working around defenders, and um, fouls kind of picked up in the third and fourth quarter, so I was kind of limited on that, but just, you know, finding the open lanes and kicking out to my teammates or whether that's finishing at the hoop and um, knocking down free throws, so. Just, uh, I guess, uh, thoughts on being able to uh, be in a regional final here next week? Yeah, it's been a while since we've done this, so we're super excited. We're really motivated. Uh, we're a team of 14, 15, how many on our bench, however many, and, you know, we all get along really well. We play Norwalk on Tuesday, so we beat them earlier this season, but they're a really good ball club, so we're really excited to play them again here at home and have good energy. Every day, every time we come into the gym to practice, we are 100% there and we focus hard and we get things done and that really helps us to do this at games. That's on the win tonight. Thank you. All right, once again, 49-32 win here for Lewis Central over Carroll from the regional semifinal here tonight. Here now with head coach Hanif and, and obviously coach, a really strong first half for you guys. They, they closed the gap a little bit there in that second, but you hold on. Just uh, uh, thoughts and takeaways here from this one. Uh, yeah, I thought we got off to a great start. Uh, obviously, the difference there in the first half was our defense. Um, I think they scored six points uh, the first half, uh, I believe it was, and, and a lot of those, those on all those six points were scramble-type plays that uh, – you know, they came up with the ball or on a rebound or something and finished around the hoop. Um, so it all started with our defense. Uh, second half, I thought we came out just a little bit stagnant on offense. Um, maybe didn't execute as well as we had the first half. Uh, turned the ball over there a little bit too much to let them get back in the game. And they started hitting shots. And, uh, you know, uh, the big dagger, I think, was when Lucy buried that three uh, when they were making their run. And, uh, and after that, we handled the ball pretty well and played pretty good defense. Sure, yeah, obviously, you mentioned the defensive side. Yeah, you held them to six points in that first half. What would you guys feel was really working on that side of the ball for you guys tonight? Uh, nothing new for us. Um, you know, we we play pretty good defense, and uh, uh, I thought we scrambled around. I thought we found shooters. The other thing I thought we did a really good job of was uh, holding them to one shot, one every trip down, because um, they've got some very good rebounder, a little size, um, and that was a concern for us. But uh, you know. Um, we held on, and you know, like we told the girls, at this time of year, it's survive in advance. It doesn't matter what happens. A W is W, and you just move on. Certainly, you mentioned uh, Lucy Scott hit that big three there late in that one. She leads the way for you guys tonight, 19 points. Speak to speak to her performance, and I know she also had a little bit. She helped out on that defensive side as well, too. Yeah, she. I mean, Lucy's Lucy, you know, and uh, 
she's she makes us go you know and her and brooke and uh um you know she that's i think that's a quiet 19 you know i i i think she, you know she'll tell you probably more than i will that if she buries a couple more it's 30 point night for her but uh you know lucy's been a you know she is who she is she's a shooter she's a scorer she plays hard uh defensively she gets a lot of tips i don't know how many steals she had tonight but uh, her and AJ at the top of that 2-3 with Macy Vetter rotating in has really uh, been good to us. And obviously you mentioned Brooke Larson as well, 14 points for her. She has to obviously go to the bench there late in that fourth quarter, but just kind of kind of speak to her performance and what she brought to the floor for you guys tonight. Well, you know, Brooke's playing a little dinged up, um, uh, but she's sucking it up and, and uh, she's a competitor. Uh, you know, I don't think you can hold her out of a game. Uh, I don't think she would allow that to happen. But, uh, you know, she's so dang athletic. We talked about this before. She does so many good things. Um, we just appreciate her effort. And, uh, you know, sometimes she gets a little going a little fast. But, uh, you know, what are you going to do? Are you going to tell her not to do it? It would be crazy, too, because she does really good things when she gets going. So, you obviously mentioned that big three there from, uh, uh, from Scott there late in that quarter. How big was that for you guys to be able to break that run and uh, break a little bit of a dry spell offensively? Oh, that was huge. Uh, you know, and I think that was the dagger that, that kind of sealed the game for us. Uh, we were struggling to score there a little bit. They were making a run. They had all the momentum. Uh, I think Avery kicked the ball out to Lucy for a three, wide open three, and she buried it. Um, and we called timeout and kind of get readjusted, and then uh, we kind of rolled from there. But, uh, yeah, that was a huge three, no doubt about it. Obviously, just a kind of thoughts, obviously, being able to uh, advance here to a regional final against Norwalk on Tuesday. Well, you know, it's a goal to get to the to the well every year. Uh, we talked about being 32 minutes away, but we're going to have to play our best basketball. We know that. And, uh, you know, and see what happens. Execute and effort. And those are things, and I've said this 100 times to them, those are things we can control. Can't control the ball always going in. But uh, if we come out and execute and give good effort, we give ourselves a heck of a chance. Congrats on the win tonight. Thank you very much.